Hi, so here we are on day 10 of this video diary. I realised yesterday when I put the one up that I put day 8. As well, I said day 8, but it was day 9. So um, I was so chilled, I just left it. <laughs> so this is day 10. Uh, I had a great day today. I've um, been putting together the tele seminar series, which is coming together really well, and I'm getting really excited about it. Uh, some great speakers lined up uh, who will be sharing their knowledge and wisdom for you know, helping us step into ourselves and and learn things that we can do to uh, help balance ourselves and uh, really step into our, our higher purpose and begin living from that place. So that uh, is really amazing. I've been really enjoying that. And just making uh, the joy of relationships with other people, you know, getting to know other people and appreciating other people and the work that they're doing and um, yeah, some fantastic people in the world, and, and that's really, really nourishing. So that's what I've made, been doing mostly today, which has been really cool. So it's all going in the right direction as far as the law of attraction goes, because for me, I long to be sharing this kind of knowledge and wisdom with others and helping other people to awaken to their higher selves and start uh, living more from the heart, from a heart space. And, and making those connections so that we all feel more nourished. So I really feel quite excited that uh, that is where we're all heading, uh, which is really cool. And so it's really nice to be um, to be putting the tele seminar together, which feels like a real step towards um, sharing and, and and being out there. So that's very exciting. So good, you know, law of attraction stuff all kind of happening and opportunities coming and. It's really interesting um, getting out there, isn't it? Like I was thinking about how where we we set, um, uh, how, you know, where we want to be, and, and then the opportunities come. But we also have to take action. It, we can't just sit there and expect it to arrive on our doorstep. And it reminds me of that story where where the chap was um, there was a flood, and, and and he was sitting on a roof of a house and praying to God to save him. And first of all, something like a boat comes past and he says, no, it's OK, I'm asking God. And and then, um, I don't know, a helicopter comes and he says, oh, no, I'm waiting for God. And then when he drowns and, and he says to God, you know, when I was asking for you, he said, well, I sent a boat and a helicopter. So it really is it kind of, you know, like when we kind of want more money, where it's not just going to drop onto the doorstep in a bag, we need to go out and take some action to achieve uh, what it is that we desire. So that's... Um, yeah, that's quite an interesting thought. And just um, also another thing was uh, perseverance. My niece shared with me a story of um, somebody in her work who had persevered and rung someone every week for nine months to, to um, in an attempt to get this chap's business. And she was just about to give up when he actually agreed to see her and gave her the business. And he said that it was her persistence which had made him see her because he knew that if she was going to be that persistent about getting his business, she was going to look after his business. So that struck me as a really interesting thing where we, uh, um, yeah, it may feel we're bothering someone or, or something, but it can have quite a different effect depending on, on the interpretation. So I thought that was quite an interesting thing. And also just the, that perseverance, you know, sometimes things are happening that we can't see. Sometimes things are going on you know, other things falling into place or slotting into place that we can't see. Which, you know, I guess is where we surrender and hand it over to the universe to create those bits. And then when it really comes into our path, then we step up and take action. So, yes, yeah, so that's me today. So day 10. I can't believe we're a third of the way through already. It's, um, doesn't time fly when you're having fun? But time flies anyway, doesn't it? No matter what's going on. So that's really quite amazing. So my um, love and best wishes to you. And I will see you tomorrow for day 11. Thanks very much.